Good morning, everybody. It's me again, Crazy Bag Lady. It's Monday morning. I don't like Monday mornings. I do say this every week. But <laughs> look at the weather. Although it is actually slowing down. Uh, the rain has been absolutely pouring. It's been awful. <laughs> it is now about 20 to 10. Um, and it is easing off a bit. So fingers crossed it'll stop in a bit. But it's my mum's birthday. Yay! Bless her. So my mum is... I think 74 today, she'll kill me for giving her age away. <laughs> no, she won't really, she just says age is just a number. So my mum's 74, bless her. So me and Ruby, when Ruby gets up, because she's having a bit of a lie-in, um, we're going to go and get her a couple of balloons for her birthday. And I think I need to get some more wrapping paper. And then later on, she's having a bit of a family lie, little get-together at her house. So we are going to my mum's later. So anyway, good morning. Lipstick of the day. Amy, I hope you're okay, my darling. I know you're having a bit of a rough time at the moment, so sending love to you. So, li Avon uh, lipstick of the day is Avon uh, Flawless, and it's on their matte lipsticks. I must remind myself to buy a full-size one of these. This is only like a sample one, but the colour is so lovely. It's like a, like a neutrally colour, but it's like got a bit of pink to it. And it's just so, so nice. I really, really like this colour. I must make a note of it and write it down because I forget sometimes which are my favourites. But I have to say, this colour is absolutely beautiful. So this is an Avon matte lipstick. It's one of their new ones. And the colour is flawless. And I think it's lovely. Anybody could wear this. It's so nice. Ooh, right, we're in the car. We've made it. It's about half past ten. Um, I've got a nip to post office. And then we need to go across get some balloonies and uh, a little bunch of flowers if we can find some flower shop. Ready? Let's go! We've arrived! So I wore my mask in the post office. I said to Ruby, we waiting in the car. I said to Ruby, it was awful. Every time I breathe, breath, breathe, my glasses smogged up every time. <laughs> it's so horrible. So I don't know, but I've got to wear it again in a minute. But it's horrible when your glasses smuggle. I think if you haven't got glasses, I don't think I would feel as bad. It's the fact that you feel like you can't breathe, but also you can't see. <laughs> Not nice, is it? And I tried to tuck my glasses, the mask under my glasses, but it still didn't work. Ooh, not many people about. How's that fancy hairdressers again? <laughs> it's cool, isn't it? to go in and it's short. Look at the teapot. She's so cool, isn't she? Oh, what a shame. Oh, maybe there's an elephant in there as well. Are you being booped? <laughs> Take this bloody mask off. Oh god, that's horrible. I don't like that mask at all. It's horrible. Oh, wow. oh right. I don't like that mask. I don't like that mask at all. Oh, every time you breathe, the lining sucks into your face. Um, so as you're breathing, this bit like comes into your mouth and stuff. It's horrible. So whether I can sew it down so it doesn't stick to my face, I don't know. That was bloody horrible. Every time I breathe, my glasses steamed up. How can this be the new normal? Mm. Ruby's alright, she doesn't have to wear one for another two, two months. months. And you'll have to wear one as well. Oh! Yeah. Anyway, Jane, stop moaning. It's to keep everybody safe. But I do need to find a better mask that doesn't stick in my mouth. And... <laughs> somehow to prevent my glasses from steaming up but I think my glasses are so big and they're now covered in rain look <laughs> yeah because they're so big they smog up because I tried I've tried everything but nothing worked oh, anyway right so that's over with for the day we got the balloonies yay we got some sunflowers for my mum um and some for my brother because it was my brother's wedding anniversary as well so I got them a card and some flowers so ah, we got a little treat from Bursa Cape Shop didn't we we've got a donut 
Ooh. So we're going to start being good again tomorrow, but today will be another day. So we've got a day and not. a challenge. Basically, you've got to say I'm doing it and you have to try not to lick your lips. <laughs> so that'll be later. Right, let's go home. Ah, right, we're here. So we're home. So it's 12.35. Uh, I need to rustle up some dinner for me and Ruby. There's only me and Ruby here today because James has gone out with his friends some dinner. Um, so it seems really quiet, but the builder is back tomorrow. Um, but he's doing my floor tomorrow, so I'm very excited about that. I can't wait to see the floor. Ooh, that'll start to make it feel more finished off, I think. Um, still waiting for my door. That's going to be like the beginning of August. It's horrible not having a front door. Like, we've got one, but you can't open it or anything, so I have to keep going around the back. It's a nightmare, especially when it's raining. All oh, right, so let me rustle up some lovely dinner for Ruby, and then we've got to pack some presents for my mum's birthday. In fact, I'm going to ring my mum while I make my dinner. I'm going to multitask. All oh, right, there's our naughty dinner. Mm -hmm. It's so nice, yeah. Ruby. Yeah. <gasps> it smells lovely. Yes, Woo! Yes, yeah. She's got the better dinner that we have. <laughs> yes we have haven't we I'm so full now i've eaten all that it was delicious though so nice so now i've got some washing up to do empty dishwasher tidying up then i really really need to get my mum's birthday presents wrapped wow i've done my washing up and i needed to look at something on the internet and then my friend accompanied me on my knee and we've been sat here ever since and it is now two o'clock i really need to wrap these presents i'm gonna run out of time i've just got my lazy head on you know when you just sit still and think can't bother to move I feel I need to. It's no good hiding in the fluffy cushion. We can still see you. <laughs> Does Monday make you feel like this? Look, she's buried herself. Are you not coming out? <laughs> oh, right, I've dragged myself out of my chair. It was so comfy. So I've got some beautiful wrapping paper. Look at this. And this one's got little swans on it. It's so sweet. And then here's all the presents. So that uh, that book that we got that's really good. And then I've got some beautiful wind chimes, some gardening gloves, some lavender, what she wanted, because she makes crafts and stuff like I do. Um, some little tins of like different gins and stuff that I thought she might like. Um, dark chocolate there's all sorts of little goodies for her bless her so i need to get them wrapped up wrap my little book up that's all about me mum and then i thought what's that bit of writing there it says it's really funny it says warning less than 0.02 percent of people will read this message it make this makes you a rare breed we like that it's great minds like yours that leave no stone unturned that discover new life cure diseases and push forward the very frontiers of human exploration your curious mind can and sometimes lead you into troublesome situations we believe all things considered it's worth it but you have been warned now go forth and enjoy the path less traveled the world needs more people like you <laughs> that's so funny right jane get on with the rabbit oh, right that's the presses all wrapped and done well oh, it took longer than i thought it was going to do it's now three o'clock time is just flying oh now i'm thinking what am i gonna wear <laughs> i don't know what to wear um Oh, it's so strange, isn't it? Obviously, because we're going to be in my mum's house. Obviously, I have to keep away from each other. Um, but my mum's house is quite warm. It's warmer than my house. So if I wear this, I'll probably be too warm. Um, but at the minute, I'm cold. So I'm like, I, don't, I really don't know what to wear. And obviously, I've got to look quite nice because it's my mum's birthday. Um, well, I might get me thinking at on, aren't I? It's times like this when you think, I've got nothing to wear, even though you've got loads of clothes. Oh. <sighs> right, well, I was looking for something to wear. I thought... Oh, here's an old scarf. Um, it's not real Louis Vuitton, or I don't think it is. I'm sure it's not. So, um, it's like a floaty scarf, but I've wrapped it over double, put it over my mouth, and I can breathe a lot. Ooh, no glasses steaming up, and it feels a lot more comfy. Obviously, it's a bit warm around my neck, um, but it's certainly a lot, lot comfier. I can sort of breathe. Um, and I'm sure it's still safe, obviously, because I've done it double so that no germs and stuff can get into my face and stuff. So, ah, oh, this might be better for our next adventure. <laughs> Certainly feels a bit better than other masks, but they're all, none of them are very nice. So I don't think I'll be going on a major shopping trip anytime soon. But at least for this, my glasses aren't steaming up, which is a big, big thing for me. I need to be able to see. <laughs> so it's now 25 past three. Maybe we're going to have a naughty donut. We were going to do the sugar challenge, but then we decided that we just want to eat it because it just tastes like, it just smells so nice. So we're off to have a naughty donut. I've been naughty sometimes. <laughs> Ooh, 
Hmm. Did you enjoy that? Yeah. What did you think to it, Ruby? Okay. So we're gonna write our dinner, and we're also gonna write our donut. Okay. So like, why did it get it? Hmm. No, no, ten. Really? Yeah. I think a ten plus. Do you? Mm. I love my dinner. I think the ham and the carbs and the sister, all of it. It's just amazing. Yeah, that was not nice. What do you rate your donut? Oh, we'll give the donut ten. Yeah. Yeah. Donut, Birds, the cake shop donuts were absolutely delicious. I think the rest everything is soft. at Birds is. Yeah, but they were so soft, weren't they? A lot of donuts you buy mm. hard, and they were really, really squishy. Do they have birds in other countries? I don't know, but they have birds everywhere in England. It's like a shop, it's like a bakery. Yeah. And then, like, the food's amazing. I it's Tell not, us if you not, have one, because I don't know if they have one. Like yeah, do you have a bird's cake yeah. shop anywhere near you? They do in England. Well, I think they do everywhere, but not sure about anywhere else. So, bird's cake shop. Wonderful. Right, I've been trying to decide what to put on. What do you wear to a family thing? You can't wear, like, a dress. It's too cold. It's too hot for, like, thicker stuff. So, I've kind of gone, like, with this little frilly thing. But now the sun's starting to come out, so I'm like, oh, my God, am I going to be too hot? Oh, so I need to sort my hair out anyway and then we should be getting ready to go. Oh, right, we finally made it into the car. Are you okay? So we're going to pick James and his friend up and they're coming as well to my mum's. Um, Nicola, I've got my little brooch on that Nicola got me for my birthday. Got my red lipstick on Amy. Um, Ava makeup, bit of shimmer going off. Um, oh my god, the sky looks a bit black over here and no coat. <laughs> so I hope everyone's going to like a present. So off we go to my mum. Happy birthday, darling. Out. Are you 21 again today? No, I've been told I'm not 47. <laughs> okay. Right? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. See, for reverse your numbers. That's right, yeah. <laughs> no, it's no, not. Yeah, you're not 47. Oh, well, there you go then. 47 today. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Happy yeah. birthday, yeah. dear. <laughs> right, my dears, I'm home. I'm home. So I think my mum had a really, really lovely birthday bless her. She doesn't do that for 74, does she? So it was lovely to share it with her and all my family and stuff. Obviously, I didn't really film much at my mum's because I don't really make it public that I'm a YouTuber as such. So I haven't really explained to my brothers and stuff that I make videos, so it's a bit complicated, so I just don't say anything. <laughs> anyway, my dear, so I'm going to love you and leave you because it's actually 10 o'clock at night, it's really late. So, uh, many thanks for being there today. So, if you do enjoy a bit of real life, then please subscribe to my channel and come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. So, my little eBay shop, my Avon shop, the links are down below. Huge shout out to my queenies. And I'll love you and leave you and speak to you tomorrow. Please take care. Bye.